cocktails. I'm Derek. That's Dan. That's Ian. We're making. We're not making anything. We're, no, we're just gonna drink some shit. So uh, Peggy sent us these in the mail, probably like three months ago now. But I don't record that often. Um, these are uh, quite a few. Unfortunately, we might end up falling to the floor, but quite a few products from the Napa Distillery. This is rye whiskey finished in port casks, small batch, handcrafted, double barrel, Panama rye. Not sure why it's Panama. There's no Panama in California, right? Maybe there is. I could be stupid there. Maybe it's a Panamanian style. Sure. Yeah. Um, so one of the things I noticed, this is a rum cordial. So this one is uh, rum slingers. And it's a rum cordial, which means it's going to probably be sweeter than rum. But it's also 40% alcohol by volume. This one's 42. This is 40, and it's a bourbon cordial. Yeah. yeah. And this is so, almost breaking the other glass, and it is... It's like an old-time gin. Old-time oh, It's also 40%. Gin. So they're all 40%, so they're all normal spirit strength, but they're labeled cordials. So we're going yeah. to stronger with sugar cut in or something. I don't know how you do that, I'm, but size well, you isn't just, my thing. You, you just distill it to higher than 40. And you, you, yeah. yeah. You, just you distill it to higher than 40 anyway. You don't distill this to 40 and then just... Right, because then you can't... You right. know how distilling works. Yeah. Come on. No, no. I'm just talking about the other half. So you got 42% alcohol and then the rest is water. Mm. Yeah, but it's yeah, sugar. It's diluted. Yeah. Right. Right. Hmm. It's a little sweet. See? It's a little sweet, he says. We could do it in black and white. It's good. That? Yeah. Oh, we should do that. Old timey. I did one of those. You ever see yeah, that old timey video? You can click up here. You can see my old timey video. It has no words. Yeah. I re edited one of the videos yeah. that we did and I just took out all the words. That's pretty cool. Yeah. What is that, the rye? Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's spicy smelling. I tasted these when they came in. I don't remember them. I noticed, like I noticed they arrived with a little less than the yes. uh, full <laughs> wash line Everything worth is of. A uh, less. Yeah. This just <laughs> tastes like rye. There's not, I mean, it's not that sweet, right? No, it's a little sweeter than the normal rye, but it's. Really? It's spicier. Over there, open up the boxes. Mm. That's right. That's yeah. definitely sweet. Oh, like this looks like a bottle. Mm. Awesome. Every yeah. king needs a taste tester. <laughs> that, yeah, you can, sure. that you can taste like the. You can taste sugar in that one. Yeah. The, oh yeah. Which you yeah. should be able to because rum. That's cotton candy and butterscotch. Some of them. Mm. I mean, rum in general it tends to have just sugar added to it anyway. Pie hole. Yeah. Ball. Just drink it. Mainline that. Right. It's really sweet. Cotton candy, butterscotch, maybe some vanilla. Oh, see? I'm not the only one with the face. It's supposed to matter. I don't know. Like, it hit my nose in a weird way. Yeah, real men take it straight. Yeah. <laughs> I just, I just took it straight started. like a real man. You take it straight and then curve it around. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Bend you he likes over. it a little bend in it. Bend you over a little bit. Bend it like Beckham. Oh. Bend it like Schumer. You know, though? Mm. Like, I like the rye, but the rum bothers me because it doesn't taste like rum. It has all those things you said. That's sweet. That's like yeah. brown this is sugar. Sweet for me. Like this tastes like honey. Like you can sweet. sip on these in some ice. Yeah, Put a little bit of ice on these. Make a little sip, and if you're in the mood for something a little sweeter, like it, this has like a little. Um... Ooh, that's herbal. <laughs> Ooh, that's herbal. That's herbal. Ooh, that's herbal. I'm gonna wash my hair with some herbs. Some herbal shit. <laughs> Maybe that'll get you high protein tonsil wash. Ah, uh, then I'll take it straight. <laughs> see how it comes back around. Ah, I see. Yeah. <laughs> How do you spell comes there, Ian? I feel like Derek having to explain it. <laughs> it's funny because you're me. Mm. No, you. No, you're you. You're just you. No. You're, you're, just you. you're special. That's, you're the only you. I, I like being special. It, it gives me something. It's a standout su- quality. This one's sweet. This one here, Barbara? Mm. Mm. This is almost like a. Uh, the bourbon has gym. like a candy flavor to it. Yeah. Oh, it is really The spiciness like of the rye, I think, floral. works a little better. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, floral, more than herbal. Botanical. That's the, mm. so the word they use, yeah. The, this one has like an herbal flavor to it. That's almost herbal. like a, a botanical, like an herbal, like a Benedictine like or a, yeah. a, a chartreuse almost. Yeah, that's so like this really is, licorice. This is the Napa Valley yeah. Distillery, if you Google it. Oh, Jesus. Sure. I almost knocked that over and then I compensated by just put it anywhere in the shiny Yeah, fingers. just throw that shit all over. <laughs> This is what happens when you take it straight. <laughs> it's fucking cold. <laughs> <laughs> Your hand is cold. <laughs> He's like, fine. Like, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Someone's a squirter. <laughs> That's good. Set a distance record. Wow. <laughs> good job, producer. <laughs> yes. It's fine. We're going to find out how much sugar is actually Special producing. Somebody lick those fingers. 
Not you, Derek. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's like got a us. lot of coriander in there. Oh, Holy man. coriander's in my face hole. Is that what? Like, what is this thing called? Coriander bomb? Oh. Hollywood old, old, old original old Hollywood. What does that mean? That would make for an interesting gin and tonic, though. Yeah, yeah. you know what? The sweetness will help with the gin and yeah. tonic because that tonic is kind of bad. Uh, interesting. It's too bad you're at a tonic. <laughs> I know. Tonic's horrible. Yeah, so. Tonic. It's good with bitters for stomach aches. I know, it brings back childhood memories. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Tonic is good. That's good for tonic. Uh, the bourbon cordial, I'm curious on whether that's a little be, sweet. You think for like, but like, say for a new new user of whiskey sour, like, you're not no, no, no. You don't want to. Like no. Because you're already, sorry. you're already <laughs> sweeting. Because you already have like simple yeah, and. Yeah, that's sweet. Sorry, put some Maybe a Manhattan. Right. You could do a Manhattan. With, oh, a Manhattan would be good because it would cut that vermouth. Yeah, we normally use a rye for Manhattan, but I mean, you could use, use This rye food. doesn't have a lot of sugar to it, though. It no. doesn't. That rye like doesn't. It. I don't understand why. This I think is too sweet. This is a bourbon. Maybe that's why this is called a rye, and this is called a bourbon cordial, and this is called a rum cordial. Just because it's rum. Yeah, cordials usually have sugar added, right? right? So that yeah. Makes sense. But you know what's weird? My hand is not sticky. So I don't know what they use in the gin, but it's clean. Like it's not sticky. Like even vodka gives me more stickiness. What? Oh, you're gonna it's do like it? I gotta try this. Does me not believe it? Yeah, I don't believe right. you. <laughs> oh shit! I gotta drive home. <laughs> 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 you gotta go by the police station. <laughs> They're like, oh, no you smell very licorice-y. <laughs> so, <laughs> so to answer Solomon's question, the one that works best yeah, in Dan's soy sauce would be the bour That's bourbon sweet. cordial. Yeah, Not yet. I don't. Not yet. <laughs> this I don't know. You no, definitely no, don't want to put down a whiskey it. sour. It okay. doesn't smell like gin. Manhattan. Maybe like a Manhattan. So you're good. Maybe like Negroni. Negroni, Negroni to, to get rid of the bitterness. Of yeah. Like this is this is like these Maybe products to me are for Ooh, people who are afraid of too much alcohol. <laughs> like bourbon straight up. A smell bourbon cask. You can't smell. It smells like. You can't smell. It smells like I just washed my hands. He's like, oh, he's oh, like, yeah. smell this. It smells Actually, like fish. Actually, it does. It smells yeah. like fish. It smells like fish. I can't, uh, I can't, I can't feel my mouth. I can't feel my lips. And not. Look so, at this. It smells like fish. Crazy. Out of all... I'm like, your girlfriend's fucked. <laughs> 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 out of all the different... What's that thing called? Jambu flower. Jambu flower. Yeah. yeah. Out of all the different varieties from the Napa Valley Distillery... It's sweet. Yeah, see? I think the, the rye... The second sip? It really sweet. Yeah, hits one? Yeah. What are we talking about? This? Mm. Especially so, in that glass, because it takes all like the burn mm -hmm. away. Um, it's like a honey, a honey liqueur almost. It it reminds me of you can say this is Drambuie-ish, or um, uh, what's that other product that everybody drinks? Uh, Southern Comfort, no, right? It's a whiskey liqueur. It's not as spicy as a Southern Comfort. No, I know, but a Southern a Southern Southern Comfort is like a sweet bourbon, right? Yeah, with weird flavor. With, with weird flavor, with yeah. spices and stuff. But it's in that same vein of making a liqueur out of something that otherwise would just be a uh, standard spirit. Like, I don't under what I my question if if the distillery folks see this is my question is why are you making cordials versus the core spirit? Maybe they haven't nailed down their core spirit recipe, and they they have a bunch of batches of this stuff they've been working on. And they're like, oh, well, we can do this with it. And yeah. Maybe maybe they just like making things sweeter. Maybe they have a sweeter tooth. It's got to be taste. better for, like, the average consumer who's yeah. like, oh, this is so much better than the bourbon I had at uh, Bob's house or you Dave's know, there's house. There's probably a market gap for people who like this stuff because there's not a whole lot of it out there, so... Right? There's not, like, a no, big brand of... I've never seen any other cordials out there. Well, you got to think, too, and they... It's probably not... Because it's not aged that long, either. Yeah, so they're adding the sweetness to get yeah. um, some of the... the because they can't, they don't have, yeah, they're probably, they Thank probably you. haven't been distilling it for that long. Yeah. Yeah, they, I, I didn't honestly go through too much of the history. Because it's funny, like the gin definitely, I mean, isn't sweet. The rye doesn't seem that sweet. No, that's where I was a little bit confused. It's at Napa the bourbon Distillery. They make core spirits and yes, they will see it. NapaDistillery.com for drink and food recipes. Oh, they do make core spirits. Interesting. I think they're interesting. I think so that that makes sense. Like they have a core spirit, but then they make out these as variations. Like I could. Yeah, this I mean, looks like something you see maybe when you walk into you know their exclusive yeah, tasting hall. Something to try. Right, something and they're different. bringing you through their tasting hall, and you want to be able to I taste mean, a different a, product. Like say, like if you want to just drink this over like the rocks. Right. You know, it's a it's an easier sipper because that could be a good. It's for sweeter. Too. The yeah. rocks. See the, these. 
I, this is just a little too sweet for me. You don't, the rum's pretty sweet. But it's sweet. Yeah, but it's, see, the rum like is normal. Like the rum, yeah, because it's always sweet. rum. Normally, I drink like sweet, like yeah. bourbon. I like the start of the rum. I don't care for the finish. Mm. I don't know why there's a flavor in there that I don't know what it is, but. I like the gin sweet. though. The gin definitely could be. Yeah, the gin's fine. Different, yeah. And, and I'm quite surprised at how much you could pour the gin in your hands. Yeah. Everything's fine. Yeah, it's always Ian. Ian's very confused. Yeah, amazed. I know. He I even know. shoved it in my face and didn't even smile. Yeah, and he didn't um, even mind. That was no. my issue. Um, Last time I shoved it in his face, he was not happy. No. no. It's a different story. <laughs> That's a story for another time. That's a yeah. story for a different podcast. That's thing. creepos, though. Yeah, it's a creepo podcast. <laughs> Off camera in private company. Right. Yeah. We're going to need to bring out Those the tapes pineapples. are super expensive. Wait, there's no company. <laughs> <laughs> no one wants to see that. <laughs> You're right. Unsubscribe. Very select. Oh. Very select. Yeah, very there's people select. out there who look like fat, hairy, bald guys. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure of it. I haven't found them yet, but I think they're out there. And middle aged, <laughs> half Asian men. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's got taste. Yeah. Well, this just went sideways and then back again and sideways again. <laughs> <laughs> so, let's end this right here. Sidebar, right. more videos. Reviews and shit. Down below, bartenderstarterkit.com where you want to go to buy your bartender starter kits because why wouldn't you go there to buy all your shit? Exactly. That's it. Fun and care. if you don't have real shit, get some shit. Right. Don't be a shit. He's just buzz killing us. We're having fun. We're in this. <laughs> We're in this shit right now. Right now. What's each side <laughs> drink? <laughs> <laughs>